from dehydration to stomach cramping to leg cramps, Charlie horses. It's, it's brutal. There's nobody out there. There's no other thing like this in the world. It's the most challenging thing I've ever done. When you're going 100 mile an hour and you hit a wind drift or a ice, ice ridge, it can definitely ruin your day. I don't know what the wind chill is, 55 below and going 90 mile an hour. That's some things you don't like to think about, but you have to. It's, it's brutal. The 2011 Iron Dog featured 28 teams racing 2,000 miles from Wasilla, Alaska to Nome and then to Fairbanks. That's exactly what this is. It's a marathon. You have to be mentally ready, physically ready, mechanically ready. Polaris has a nice little streak going here. They won the Iron Dog in 2009 and 2010. No doubt this year they're looking for a three-peat. It's hard to find good rubber. We caught up with the 2009 winners, Todd Minnick and Nick Olstad, one day before the big race. It's quite a wild ride. I mean, where do I start? Todd, why don't you start by telling me how much practice time you guys put into this? Nick and myself go out and ride 2,500 to 3,000 miles, just as hard as we can ride. So, why do it? What we do, I guess. Being a half a bubble off, I guess, probably helps too. 